Well, 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 FaZe Clan have decided to put out a little fucking recruitment challenge. And instead of five people joining up the FaZe 5, they've decided, hey, fuck the lot of years, only one of years are joining. You know, with the FaZe 5, you got a top 100, then a top 20, and then you got five people that join. Now, it's just fucking one person that joins. Now, there is still a top 20, but instead of 15 people going home crying themselves to sleep, and five winning, and celebrating, and getting their lives changed, this time, there'll be 19 crying themselves to sleep, and one person joining, saying, fuck the lot of years. Now, it's safe to say, for all those participating, you definitely got your work cut out for you. Now I did go for this recruitment challenge last year and I fucking clearly lost because here I am still not in phase and still a fuckwit. I mean I didn't even make the top 100 and I felt like I created my fucking most finest pristine piece of content I've ever created on this platform. You know I put my balls to the wall for that. I really did. I put my heart on the line. Wore my heart on my sleeve. From the vlogging to the tattoo to the Call of Duty to the Fortnite to everything. I felt like the variety was pristine. I felt like it was the perfect amount of seasoning on the steak. But unfortunately it didn't cut the cheese. It just wasn't enough. There was a hundred people that were better than me. And hey, I respect that. Now instead of crying myself to sleep as a failure for losing, I simply carried on. And in that time, we've bought a house, we've become a Twitch partner, pumping out the vlogs on the vlog channel, we're smashing out the gaming videos on this channel, and we've actually had a lot of growth. We just carried on doing what we do every single day. We've been doing this shit since 2012. You know, winning or losing a recruitment challenge doesn't change a thing. A lot of people jump on their grind just for the challenge, but bro, we do this shit every single goddamn day. It doesn't change. Every single day of the week. We're on a 650 day stream streak. We do not stop. Nothing comes easy in life. You're gonna get knocked down, you're gonna get kicked to the fucking ground, you're gonna get your head stomped on, you're gonna get your jaw shattered against the fucking cobblestones by some mafia man in Italian leather shoes. Probably not, I think I've been playing a bit too much fucking GTA RP, but uh, you guys get the gist. No matter how many times someone knocks you down, you get back up, carry on, you get on the saddle, you ride the fucking horse. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. You know, it's gonna be hard for me to top my last response because we spent thousands of dollars on it, I felt like we'd done everything right. And yet, and I made the top 100 was disheartening, but as I said, it don't change no goddamn thing. So hey, we're back at it again. We're gonna compete in this challenge. And hey, I mean fuck. Prizes for this challenge were a lot better than the prizes for the last. You win $1 million in crypto, a $250,000 signing bonus with G Fuel. And last but not least, you join FaZe Clan and you get an R35 GDR Skyline. I mean, I'll be fucking damned. I think everyone's dumb not to go for this challenge. That shit there is life changing. That's about 1.5 million US dollars, which is about 2.3 million New Zealand dollars. That's life changing, bro. So yeah, I'm going for the goddamn challenge. Am I going for it for the money? Nah, I mean, this is what I do every single fucking day. That shit's just a bloody bonus. Now, the challenge starts on Thursday, and I thought I'd give you guys a little public service announcement to let you guys know what's going on. I'm gonna need all your guys' support. We're gonna need the ratings on the videos through the fucking ceiling. I'm gonna need you guys tweeting out hashtag Faze Murray, replying to the FaZe Clan tweets. I tell you something, we are going a goddamn war. We're up against over 200,000 people, and hey, I'm gonna make sure I stand out from the crowd. I'm gonna show you guys that originality, that creativity. I'm gonna be doing shit no one's ever done before. Just like I did for my last challenge, which wasn't enough. We're sticking to the same theory, so who knows what's gonna go down. But hey, we fight every fight like it's our goddamn last. It's either me, or it's you. It's fight, motherfuckers. That was harsh, I'm just joking. Good luck to all of you going for it. Wish you nothing but the best, I really do. And um, just know, it's gonna be some tough competition. It really is, for all of us. That's all I gotta say. Yeah, it's a pretty good speech. Well, it's currently 4.41 in the morning.